Hey y'all, just coming back from the gym and I got a message for y'all today per huge. So, I was listening to a sermon. As y'all know, I've been doing that a lot lately. And the, this message, this message just rings in my head because it's confirmation of something that I've been thinking for a very long time about people. Do you ever wonder why you look around and you see some people that are so talented, right? And so gifted in this life that you wonder how is it that they're not further ahead than they are? What you have to understand, if this is a message for you or someone you know, God is slow to sometimes give us our blessings because we have to change the core of our hearts. And what I mean when I say that is some people hate so badly on those around them that are elevating or even in a place opposite of where they are that they block their blessings because they are spending too much time being hateful. God wants us to look at others and be inspired and encouraged by what they're doing so that we can get to where they are. It wasn't easy for them, just like it's not going to be an easy road for us. But they fought the good fight, did the work, had the blood, sweat, and tears, and kept persevering even in the midst of it all. And God blessed them when he was ready. Sometimes you have to understand the reason why God is slow to give you the blessings that you need or that you feel like you deserve in this life is because you have to change the core of your heart. Stop being so hateful. Sometimes people hate on the very people that God sent to be a blessing to them to be of good encouragement to them. You shouldn't see others as a, as a threat, my loves. You shouldn't be discouraged by their growth, my loves. You need to use what they're doing as an inspiration for you to reach for greater and strive for more. And then maybe, just maybe, God will give you an abundance of blessing for you to enjoy on your own. This was a message for someone. I hope you take it because as I always say, it was a good one. Talk to you soon.